This has been my best ever month on YouTube. We are almost up to 2,000 subscribers. Kind of crazy. And today we are starting a playthrough. I think I'm going to do a full playthrough. We'll see. Of a game called... Holy loudness in my ear. But not in yours. My volume was really high. Adjusting it right now. I think I'm going to do a full playthrough of a game called Stuck in Time. It used to be called like Loop Odyssey, I think. Something like that when I first looked into it. This is kind of like an idle time looping game. There are a few browser based games that feel similar. But this one seems like it might be really good. You wake up alone in the woods with no memory. Next, you are stuck in a loop. Every time your mana reaches zero, you are teleported back to the starting point. Drag and drop actions to add them to the list. Click go to start the loop. We'll see how much I can figure this out. I always struggle a little bit with first figuring out like the UI for these games, it feels like. Build a loop that reaches here and fight one rat. Cool. So that would be incorrect. We're going to move to the right. We're going to go up. We're going to fight. And then we're going to hit go. Can we speed things up? Okay. Can we turn off the tutorial? Because I would love that. No. What are we doing? Where is continue? Okay. We're still playing. Extend your loop. Load. Save. There's an action list. I feel like there has to be a turn off the tutorial, but maybe not. Hit go again. Extend your loop to interact with the fireflies flies, and replenish your mana. Alright. To interact will be E. One important thing for these kinds of games is learning like the hotkeys. It seems like. We'll see. I'm looking over at my volume levels. They look acceptable. It might be really repetitive music, so we might switch over to the lo-fi. We'll see. Extend your loop to reach the altar and spend it. Plus one spirit is a good choice. Killing a rat gave you one level to spend. Okay, we level up. Dead rats. There's still meat on them, though. I want to make these go away, but I can't do that. We're going to interact. Hit go. How do I make these go? Leave. <laughs> I am so confused. Hitting. Wait, hitting escape did something. No, it's just because I did a new thing. Fireflies. Something magical emanates from them. Three left. 92. 65. Two. Zero. <laughs> Repeating the same action increases... God, I hate... Okay. The tutorial is going to bug the hell out of me, but hopefully it's over soon. Now craft a loop that reaches the fence and fight to break, fight it to break free. Turn on auto loop to restart automatically and grind fami familiarity. <laughs> Good. Hopefully that was the end of the tutorial. That would be amazing. It looks like it because it cleared my loop. Interact. Come down here. So, were there multiple of these? I'm not sure. Come down here. I don't even know what it had said. Like, my mind just blanked out whatever it said to do down at this gate. I just like exploring these games. So, we have 700 total mana. I think it used to be 500. We become a red spirit. I can turn on auto loop. Hit go. And watch what happens. We have a storybook. Kill a rat. Gain XP. The fireflies give you plus 500. Interesting. I want to see... So it looks like there are still rats here, maybe. And there are still... There were three fireflies, and now there are two. This is still green. Like, can I do these actions? So if I hit plus... Could I fight them three times? One spirit, max mana. One heart. Well, so I have a one here. 
Okay, I'm going to the altar. And... <laughs> because I'm doing the interact option, I am getting one of this. Is that correct? If I change... So let's try speak instead. Hit X and see if that puts a 1 into heart, which would increase the game speed versus max mana or combat damage. I think I'm kind of getting this UI. It's similar to- no, okay, I am very wrong. That is not the thing that happened. Or, no, okay, so my change right here, switching this over to green, it didn't take effect yet. I'm editing this, but I haven't, like, exported my list until now. Update path on the next loop. Okay, so that's what I would have to do to have my changes apply. Now I expect, there we go, plus one. Green altar, a quiet place to use your XP and level up. I have half of a heart. Out of 24. <laughs> How do I see my XP? Also, the music stopped. To get the music to go again. There is... Okay, so let's go down here. And let's interact with these fireflies and see what that does. Assuming I can get past this gate, but I think I can. We'll find out. With only 500 max mana. I am fighting the rats three times. I did not get past the gate. So if we turn off auto loop, we can see where it gets stuck. Which will be right after I run out of mana opening this gate. Yeah. Weird. Okay, wait. Let's actually click this. Moldy fence. Can't cross it, but you could break it if you hit it hard enough. It takes 350 mana... I have zero fighting familiarity, even though I've been fighting with the rats. I have five crossing familiarity. I have six fighting familiarity. Okay, so you get film familiarity with every block. Every square, so I should have zero. Yeah, because I've never crossed this square. What is going on with the music? Music! If I click this, I go to the main menu. Okay, and then the music comes back on. Continue. I think we're gonna end up playing our own music at some point. I do want to get this going to auto before I go read that. So to get this to auto, I'm going to go back to this one, modify it to be the max mana again. Get ri I don't know if I could do more than one action here. Update the list, hit play, see where it gets stuck, read the storybook. The Mysterious Player. We've had multiple updates. Loop zero, I'm covered in sweat, my, reg my right leg hurts like hell, and I have a large open wound on my left side. What happened to me? I approach one of the fireflies carefully. This old stone altar lights up. Okay, so these are all the things I've done. I noticed that every time I perform the same action, I become more familiar with it and can do it a bit quicker. If I keep doing the same thing over and over, I might be able to leave this place. So what did we get stuck on here? I have zero mana. 350 cost. Is there a way to see how much mana I had? when I was at this place. I have zero fighting familiarity. I have two speaking. Oh, so I could do fighting at this place. I have walked through here a bunch. Hmm. My th current thought is, which one is which? Right here is where I'm using that. I would like to go. So I'm going to clear all of this. We interact with this altar. Then, <laughs> okay, can we reset this? Because it's not letting me add steps. Why can't I add steps? I would like to go up. My keyboard is no longer working. 
where before it was. Okay, move up. Oh, it's WASD, not the arrow keys. We interact with this again. Then we come back down using this path because that's what we're familiar with. Come over here, interact with this, come down, interact, hit play. I don't know that I really need to fight. There are more than three rats. There's seven left. We could be fighting a lot of rats. So mana fills up, come down, go over, open the gate. Whoa, that is taking forever. We're just like waiting there. Huh. Oh, I need to fight it, not interact with it. I understand. I get it. And this, let's see if we can fight 10 rats. Hit go. Let's do this. Let's see how many rats. So we can fight two, three. Three is all I could fight. I had the correct number. Hit go. If we leveled up strength. Okay, and I see I have two levels that I could be spending at this altar, I think. So we fill up mana. Come down. I expect we'll break through this. Wow, it takes forever. Okay. But look, we're through. I understand. We didn't have enough time to use the fireflies. But... Okay, I'm so confused. I thought this was going to say one. And that we would have enough familiarity now. Okay, so... Maybe I have to do this action like three times before it levels up to a one. I think I'm getting it. There's still a firefly left here. I should be spending two levels at this altar for sure. Hmm. So if I got my max mana up twice, how much does that? It doesn't take that mat. It doesn't take that much mana to do that. That is which one? That's this one right... No, it's this one right here. Hit a plus one. Update the list. Hit go. I think we're doing it. Okay. Okay. How, okay, so really we could use two of those fireflies, but my max mana is now 900. I'm not going to make it down in time still. <laughs> Are we close? We did level this up at least. I don't know how much that matters. Hmm. Okay. So, this one. Change that to a two. Hit go. So the hope is, after I use two level ups, we go back and eat two fireflies to get up to 900 mana. This is a different song. We did. So now I should be able to use a firefly here. And really, I probably want to use two. Yeah. And then... We want to explore, but I can't see where, so I'm just going to hit over to the right a bunch. Like, ten times. Okay, I screwed it up. Like, that many times. Hit go. So we have attack, we have defense, and we have mana spent per tick. We did get a new storybook item. Okay, this is what I was looking for. So this tells me how much mana I had remaining at this point. So this is fighting with the rats. Starting mana, 438. When I'm done, I have 214. And then it takes some to do this movement. And then it takes some to do this action. We found another level up. We found a fire. And what is this? Another rat's nest. Let's go. Okay, so I'm going to clear this. How much mana do I have? Okay, I'd like this to go away. Looking over, volume still looks good. It sounds loud in my ear. 
Okay, I can't see it because I just cleared the list. Whatever. We're gonna come down. We're gonna interact with this fire. We're gonna come over, interact with this twice. Come over here. Um, get up our combat twice, because we'll probably have two level ups by there. And then come over and fight the rats. That's not fight. Hit X. Fight the rats with T and do that like five times and hit play. And see what happens. I do still have enough mana that now... Let's try to fight them five times at the start and see what that does. So this gate, we've still only leveled it up once, but this might be the second level up. It was second level. Oh no, that's cross. Yeah, both of these are now at two. Good. There's still one firefly left. What does this do? Rodent affinity. Burn rodents. Increase rodent XP. What? <laughs> okay. Sacrifice mob drops. Oh, and I have three mob drops. I get it. And, okay, it gets rid of the list of things that happened. You killed a rat. We were successful in killing two of these. It looks like I still have mana left. Oh, my HP dropped. That's what happened. Also, I only got up one of the levels of body. Okay, cool. This, what were you? You are where I want to sacrifice like three of these at least. Hit play. So this time, did I update this to five rats? No, I, or yes, I did. And we died after four. Huh. Okay. I want to watch what's happening. I think I died to my health dropping. I totally did. So let's watch health. I can kill four of them without health. When does it go back up? Does it go back up? It does not. How do you heal? The campfire might heal me. It feels like that's a thing that the campfire would do. I'm liking this. Plus one. What are these plus ones? Oh, familiarity with the road. Yes. Rodent affinity. Increase rodent XP by 10%. Mana spent per tick. So what happened? I died here because I ran out of mana after doing it two times. So if I get rid of this, get rid of this, get rid of this, get rid of it, get rid of it. We change this to only be two times. We go over. We use two of the fireflies. Then what? Really, then I think I just want to explore, right? Let's just hit down like 10 times and see what happens. We do have the new book entry. Let's do that while we're getting through that gate. I saw a thing tick up. Loop 24. I throw the corpse of a rat into the bonfire. His little soul rips out of his dead body and evaporates into the sky. My sacrifice has been accepted. Very cool. I see something blinking up there. Maybe it's another bonfire? I do want to go up there. Okay, after this, I thought I only did two of those. Okay, where did I just die? I died right here. I did only do two of those. Huh. So this is a permanent buff, though, I'm pretty sure. We could lower that to be only one. Let's do that. Hit go. So 
So we fight this rat. How do I get my health higher? Or how do I get my defense higher? I could up my strength, but I can't do that until after I fight them, I think, is when I get the XP for a level up. I could go back to fight them more. No, because I don't have the health for it. How do you fight more rats? I'm slowly getting more vision up here. Okay. I die there. <laughs> I did sacrifice two in the bonfire again. I feel like I just didn't update the list. Hit go. Because why would I have died at the bonfire again? I really want a speed up, especially for this early part. But I guess as you become more familiar, you might do these parts quicker, which means that I will do the action more times. And then become more familiar and become quick. We could go off to the left too, but I want to go up. I just want to get this to level 2 so that I get more XP from fighting my rats. Okay. I thought I lowered this to 1. I did not. Lower this to 1. Wait, this one is supposed to be 2. Hit go. I didn't update the list. Update the list. Hit go. Watch our health. Huh. Six remain. We're killing four. I bet you there's a thing that heals me somewhere nearby. There has to be. Firefly, firefly. Campfire once, right? Yes. Use the campfire once, move over to these. And then why am I going down instead of up? I have one level. Okay, two levels. Why did I just die here? I am... Okay. For some reason, I'm trying to move. No, we move to the right. We use this twice. I try to go down. I can't go down. This is a tree that's blocking my way. I think I actually understand now. Okay. I would like... How much mana? So this uses 75 to walk through an unexplored path. This uses 50. This uses 47. This uses 31. This should be like my most explored, 29. So that's the cheapest one out of my 900. Going up through this would use 75. 75. Okay, I get it. I swear I get it. We are going to... <laughs> come down, come over, come up. Come over, come over. Use this, use this, come up, come up, come up. This looks like another firefly. Come over, use this, use this. Come over to the left, come over, come over. Go up to this glowing and hit E and hit go. And just see what it does. I just realized there are only two here, not three. Yeah, two left. There were three on this one, three on this one. How many rats? 10 rats. It takes 100 points to fight them, 50 to walk through. This takes 68 and 37. I'm totally getting this. I wonder if we can swim. I bet we can't. But there might be a way to like build a raft or something. Okay, my mana is gonna run out. I did not get to explore much at the end there. All right, remove all of this. Instead of doing that, I did get to go down, but I didn't get to see much of that lake. Okay, come over here. E, E, go up. This looks like this might be a tree. Ah, but that looks like a fairy or whatever it is. Firefly? Firefly. E, E. Come back down. We're going to become familiar with these paths. This does look like a tree to me. 
Go up, go up, go up. Hit E, hit play. Let's do this. This is my final loop of this video. Then we'll come back next time and we're going to get... My rodent affinity is going up, so at least we're getting some permanent buff. But we're going to figure out this starting area. And maybe explore a bunch of this darkness. That's going to be the plan for next time, I think. We'll see what we see right now at the end of this loop. Rodent affinity. How much XP do I get for sacrificing? I don't know. So that worked as expected. How many are here? One left. Okay, I ate them both, I think. What is this? It's more rats? Double critter. Well, there are two of them. <laughs> Fight them twice. One thousand. I don't even have enough max mana for that. Or 400 to just run past it. And maybe it still attacks me. It might be worth a look. A wood pile. Okay, so we probably need to check that out next time. For now, that's going to do it for this first episode. Thanks for watching. Have a good one.